Well, congratulations on your return. What was it like to be back? Yeah, it was excellent. Um, obviously, a, a good return for myself. Um, tough game. Um, pitch was quite difficult in spells. A um, bit inconsistent, but yeah, uh, at the end of the day, we, we had a good result here. Um, they, they're a top side and obviously they're you know, the 12th in the world. So, yeah, it was a good result for us. When we were awarded the penalty, had you planned on taking it pre-game or was it spur of the moment? Um, yeah, I never shy away from these things. Um, kind of just walked over, took the ball and yeah, kind of redemption uh, from Qatar. Um, obviously, I had it in my mind that I was eager to score, obviously, in my return as well. And um, thankfully, I managed to do that. A bit of a Mexican standoff too, if I could coin the phrase. <laughs> Tell us a little bit about the lead up to the penalty. Yeah, I think he was complaining the ball was a bit off the spot. Um, but that's... It's obviously in the guidelines, that's what I like to do. And yeah, we were just kind of staring each other out and you know, the referee got involved and yeah, you've got to put these things at the back of your head and not get distracted and like I say, managed to put the ball in it. Was it a distraction for you? You looked pretty focused and just pretty uh, determined to have that job in, in your mind and what you needed to do. Yeah, I was fully determined. I knew exactly what I was doing. I didn't change my mind once um, and I was confident enough. Um, so I'm thankful I managed that. Great. Uh debuts tonight as well for a couple of other boys, uh, um, obviously Cam Burgess uh, at the back and Sammy Silvera, what's it like to have uh, some of the new boys coming through? Yeah, it's brilliant, it's obviously fresh faces, um, you know, Cam's a giant, I uh, thought he'd done well tonight, Heaven H, uh, quite intimidating pair, them two, I um, thought they connected up quite, quite well, uh, confident on the ball, which is fantastic, um, and obviously, you know, Silvera came on and yeah, I think we were kind of, you know, we were we were up against the pump at the end there. Um, unfortunately, he didn't get much of the ball, but in training all week, he's been looking sharp. Um, he looks a great prospect and hopefully he can kick on. I'd like it back in Scotland, I'd imagine, with the uh, two Scottish boys uh, scoring tonight for Australia. Yeah, um, obviously it's nice, but you know we class ourselves as Aussies, um, adopted. So um, yeah, it's obviously a nice connection. Um, so like you say, it's, it's, it makes it easier to take set pieces if you've got uh, boys like that in the box and you know thankfully uh, H got on the end of it. You got a bit of a souvenir, tell us about that. Yeah, I'll say got uh, Raul Jimenez's top, uh, it's nice, um, it's always nice to have uh, memories of playing in this, you know, it's a special occasion for me um, and I, I like to take souvenirs home um, and obviously playing in a stadium like this, never, never in my wildest dreams I thought I'd be playing in stadiums like this, so it's, it's, yeah, it's surreal for myself and um, you know I appreciate, I appreciate every moment of it. Touch on uh, that uh, experience tonight, uh, the crowd, the atmosphere, the big screen. Was that a distraction? Uh, how did you find it all? Yeah, it was really loud. Um, obviously, a lot of Mexican support here, um, which is fantastic. Um, but yeah, obviously, we, we went out to silence them. Um, we'd done that to go 2 now up and obviously got loud near the end. But yeah, these, you know, it's obviously difficult to communicate. Um, but you know, these are the atmospheres that you want to, you want to play in. It gets the adrenaline going and it's fantastic. How much do you take from the fact that uh, Australia's now played Argentina in China in front of a very vocal crowd here uh, in Dallas against Mexico in front of a very vocal crowd, but you were dominating this game, uh, especially in the early stages, and put it right up to uh, Argentina as well. How much does that please you as a player and does it show maturity as a team? Yeah, absolutely. We can take great belief from it. You know, you're playing against the world champions and you're playing against the top ten side. Um, like you say, we've, we're, we're scoring goals um, and we can take great belief from it. Um, obviously, we can tweak a few things to, to get even better. Obviously, we can play much better. Um, but yeah, you know, the belief's there. We, we believe that we can go out there and, and upset anyone.